Hello, Morgan Noll here with TransWest Truck Trailer RV in Frederick, Colorado. We're located about 30 minutes north of Denver off I-25. Today I am bringing you an inventory item. This trailer is available right now. It's a 2021 Cimarron North Star three horse gooseneck with the closet tack. So I personally love this trailer. Love how this closet tack is set up the separate between that and the dressing room. But we'll take a look through it and I hope you guys enjoy this trailer. So we'll start under here right away. Um, this trailer is equipped with a hydraulic jack. And I'm telling you guys, this hydraulic jack will, will save you some time cranking and uh, downside you don't get your gym time in, but it's still <laughs> great to have. But you've got your battery box. Up here you've got your battery. And then you also have your battery cutoff switch in there. And that, that battery allows you to run your lights while you're not plugged into a truck. And then as you're plugged into the truck, it'll trickle charge that battery when that cutoff switch is turned on. So that way you're keeping that battery charged up, you're not running it low, it's gonna help out big time. Up here, you've got your hydraulic jack controls. So just up and down, and I'm gonna push it real quick just so you guys can see how it works. But so up, down, I mean, it's super simple and it's just really convenient to have. And I see it as a big plus on these trailers. Um, if we've got one here in stock that doesn't have that hydraulic jack and that's something you want, we can get it installed here in our shop. So over here on the hip side of the trailer, you've got your dressing room entrance and then you got your tack room. Um, reason why I like this a lot, you can keep your horse stuff separate from your show stuff. So you got your show shirts and everything in that front dressing room. And then you got your saddles, your blankets, bridles and everything in this tack room keep that smell out of that front i mean your clothes are probably going to get smelly anyways but you never know when you're going to need a change of clothes um, but we'll jump up in here into the um, dressing room real quick and just kind of show you guys what it's all about so up in here right away you've got this full length boot box so that's just extra storage for you be able to get lots of stuff in there your boots um, lawn chairs i mean there's a lot of stuff you can shove in here it also doubles as a step to get up here into the bed or into the gooseneck area. So extra storage for you, throw an air mattress up there. I mean, lots of opportunities and, and stuff you can do with it. So over here, so this closet tack comes into this space a little bit, but it's nice because you get this little corner for extra storage. Got lots of space over here. And then up above, you do have a shelf with a bar. So hang your clothes, hat rack, and this shelf does has a, have a lip on it, so it's gonna catch stuff from falling off when you're going down the road. Then I'm gonna swing over here. So on this wall right here, we do have some additional bridle hooks, stuff or areas to hang stuff. Um, just gonna be able to allow more room for everything that you need. And then up above right here, we do have the pre-bracing for the AC. Um, so if you want an AC installed on this one, we can do that. And then as you're walking out the trailer, um, out the door, you'll see our really bright OptiBright LED light. Um, those are going to be awesome to have, and we've got them throughout the trailer. That way you're able to see and everything. So in here in the tack room, you do have your swing out blanket pole. So that comes out. That is going to be a lot easier to layer blankets on there. If you got boots, you got to put on there and everything. Swing that out and it's just more ease of use and easier for you. Down here, you do have the brush box, extra storage space. Get your brushes, get your hoof pick, your um, fly spray. All of that can fit in there very easily. And then in the tack room, you got your three saddle racks on that back wall. We can add additional ones to that. And they are also adjustable, so you can move them back and forth, um, up and down, I should say, if you wanted more space, less space, add a couple, all of that. Over in the corner, we got a 25 gallon water tank. And then additional bridle hooks. And one thing I really like that they do in these closet tacks, they actually put a roof vent in here so you can get some ventilation, um, air it out a little bit for you. So over here on the hip side of the trailer, you got your three bus windows. Those up, open up 50%, um, be able to get your airflow going through. Got three ties on here. And then down below, 
we do have two 6,000 pound Dexter torsion axles with your 16 inch aluminum wheels. And those tires are nitrogen filled, so that nitrogen, you see that little green tab right here, that means they're nitrogen filled. That nitrogen is gonna run cooler, the PSI is gonna stay steadier, um, just overall gonna be nicer to haul around. And then it's really convenient because if you do have a slow leak and you gotta get some, get a patch, get some air in it to get where you're going, you can do that as well. It's not gonna hurt the tire. So over here on the rear of the trailer, you've got your 60-40 doors, door set up. So 60-40, uh, no ramp on this one right now, but if that's something that you'd wanna get on here, we can easily do that for you. But coming up in here into the trailer, you got your two dividers, you got your one stud stall, and then you got your partial divider. Uh, we can get pads added to them if that's something you'd want. Uh, this stud stall up above or in the front just allows you to have more um, flexibility with what you're doing with the trailer. So if you're only hauling two horses, but you're going to a show and you need to take some hay with you, you can throw it in this first stall because you do have that stud stall, extra storage um, space for you, your wheelbarrow, I mean, all of that you can throw up in that first stall. Each stall does come with the roof vent. Those roof vents push forward and they push back. So you push it forward, that's gonna be sucking that air in. You push it back, that's gonna be sucking that air out to allow you to get maximum airflow going through the trailer. Two more OptiBright LED lights. Be able to load and unload in the dark a lot easier with having those. And especially having that battery on this trailer, you're gonna be able to run those even if you're not hooked up to the truck. So if you do store back here, or get stuff back here, you can use it. Right here, we do have a strap. So this strap, it's kind of like a seatbelt material, super sturdy and super strong. Um, this just comes from the hind end. And that way, if you got a horse in that last stall, when you open the door, it's not gonna back out onto you. Um, they're gonna hit this first and go back forward. So Cimarron trailers are an all aluminum trailer. You're getting one of the strongest upright posts on the market. The strongest flooring on the market with the center every four inches and then you're also getting a half inch thick insulated honeycomb fiberglass roof and that roof has an r3 thermal value on it um, that's going to be more heat regulating so you know warmer in the winter in there cooler in the summer and then it's also dent and hail resistant up to about a golf ball size hail um, i know here in colorado that is a big plus because you never know when a hail storm is going to blow in in the summer so i'm going to shut this door real quick uh, these doors do all have latchbacks on them so that you are able to, you know, have them latched back and you're not going to be, the wind's not going to be grabbing them to blow them shut while you're trying to load horses, which I know is a pain because the wind's always blowing somewhere. But that is what the door looks like when it's partially closed. Um, so you can have this one closed, load your horses through that one door. It, there's so much flexibility in them that you can do pretty much whatever you want. But back here you do have your light switches, so your interior and exterior lights, um, excluding the tack room and the dressing room. So those will have their individual light switches in there. So over here on the head side of the trailer, you've got your drop downs on all three stalls and then your escape door on the front. The escape door does come with a chest bar, so you can have this up. Oh, give me a sec. So if you've got a horse in there and you're opening that door, that horse isn't going to try and walk out on you. That's going to stop them. Um, this escape door does have the latch back on it as well. And that closes right up. But your drop downs, you've got your jail bars. So the jail bars, they come up. And they can come down as well. Um, I really like this feature for the fact if you're going on a longer haul and you got to check on horses when you're stopping to get fuel, you can just pull this down, offer water, check on hay, give them additional hay if you need to. Uh, it just leaves you with a lot of flexibility with however you need to do it. And then it's super nice because these lock into place as well, so you're not going to be flapping against the trailer while you're going down the road. Um, it's going to a lot sturdier. I don't know if you guys can kind of hear that suction there but you know it's going to be good and sturdy and then when they are up you've got your bus window that you can open partial way if it's colder outside you can get that open and still get a little bit of airflow going through there but you're not freezing the horses out
So you do have another um, exterior light out here. So you got one on each side of the trailer. LEDs, nice and bright. Um, make it easier for you tacking and untacking in the dark. That's for sure. So this trailer is going to be sitting 610 wide. We're sitting 71 tall. And we're sitting 19 feet, 3 inches on the floor. It has an empty weight of 4,810 pounds. And those stall widths are 39 inches, the first two. And that last one's sitting at 93 inches. So this trailer is gonna be a 2021 Cimarron North Star three horse gooseneck with the claws attack. Stock number on it's gonna be 5N201301. Look that up on our website. Um, if you wanna check it out, we got some more pictures on there and everything. But if you guys have any questions on this trailer, any other trailers we have on our lot, or if you're looking at our website and you see just drawings, those are all trailers we have on order. So we have stuff coming in as well that might suit your needs. Um, and if something, you know, if you need something changed or we need to change something and it's still at the manufacturer, we can check it out for you and see if we can do it. Um, but you can call or text me at my cell phone at 970-218-5996. Uh, you can call my desk phone at 303-684-3451 or you can even shoot me an email at morgan and that's m-o-r-g-a-n dot noll k-n-o-l-l -L. i look forward to hearing from you and look forward to doing business and i hope you have a great day